Trade union leaders have called an emergency meeting at the Public Services Association head office in Port of Spain. The leaders started a high power meeting just after five on Saturday afternoon. The trade union movement is in solidarity with the PSA regarding wage negotiations for public officers. The PSA staged its third week of protests last week dubbed Blackout Reloaded, with several labor leaders joining the protest. The union say they were waging war after the chief personal officer, Stephanie Lewis, refused to increase her offer of 001%. The CPO, though, said the offer was revised with the PSA boss rejecting the offer. After that negotiation collapsed, you called on public officers to stay away from work for the rest of the week and return to work on Monday, November 8th. The PSA says its call has been a success with the health sector, sections of the judiciary and other areas being hard hit. However, Labour leaders say their meeting is designed to come up with a new course of action to put pressure on the CPU and by extension the government to rethink the offer and ensure that public officers earn a salary of at least $6,000 a month. Union leaders attended a meeting are President Watson Duke, OWTU head Ansel Roger, Joseph Remy of the CW, Vincent Gebera of Begu and other union leaders. The government has issued at least two pleas with the CPO and the union to reach a compromise and end the industrial action, saying dialogue is the only way to move forward. For CNC3, I am Otto Carrington.